We're here today at uh, Maxwell Farms near Turriff in Aberdeenshire to investigate the comparative use of tyres that work in the central inflation system, so the optimum pressure compared to the road pressure when used in the field. We've run the tractor up the field at the low and high pressure, one for road and one for field. And we've measured the rut depths, which, uh, which we can see now either side of me. So we've got the rut depth here for the low pressure tyres. And this is at about one and a half inches. We can see that the stubble has had very little compaction and is still intact. And the soil itself is still quite loose. If we move over to the second run. This is at the higher pressures. We're now somewhere close to four inches of rut depth and the stubble has been completely compacted and taken into the soil. So we can see very clearly the big benefit that we have uh, with running the tyres at the lower pressures. So comparing a section down through the, the, the actual wheelways, we've got the low pressure run here. You can see a very, a very open structure, a lot of vertical fissures, a lot of openness in there. The porosity really hasn't been compromised to a large extent, so we're going to get good water air and root movement down through the profile. Contrasting to the higher pressure run, a much higher stress, a much lower porosity in that surface zone, it's going to be more restrictive to, to roots and to air and particularly to water, so infiltration is going to be far, far more compromised. The low pressures that we're going with these tyres now are lower than we've been before. We're down to 12 PSI, which we've never previously been down to. And the results of going down to that 12 PSI is amazing. Uh, the lack of compaction compared with what we had before is tremendous. Michelin, a better way forward.